use the nuclear free zone. Do you have any atomic weapons? Only a small one. Hand it over, Bucko! Now you're welcome. We start with St. Mary's Church on the edge of town. You'll note the tower has four sides. The spire only three. There are only two in the world. And one of them is here in Whanganui. Oh. Shall we go on? Where are we? Goodbye Park! It's been giving pleasure to people around here since 1917! You've done it again! Yahoo! There's do-it-yourself fun! Wahoo! Give him a hand fun! Go for a ride! Mini golf! Use your imagination! Go-karts! You'll be amazed at what you can find here! We've even got our own jet boat! We've been using the river for a long time. Very handy for transport in the old days. Sports, of course. All kinds of recreation. Who are you really? Motley. And now let's get across the river. How? Oh, no. Okay. Virginia Lake. Used to be the city reservoir, but now it's used purely for recreation. Who are you really? Motley, the spirit of fun at Wanganui. I fell asleep at a river cave in 1863. I wake up every now and again to bring a bit more zing back to Wanganui. In 1940, we built a magnificent winter garden. In 1979, we came up with a walk through Avery, just like the one at Regent's Park. More than three kilometers of beautiful bush walks around the lakeside. And the lake itself is nicely sheltered. Perfect for a bit of boating. What kind of boat are we on here? Boat? It's a fountain. Ah. Apart from getting wet, what else do you do around here? Plenty! We have great racing facilities. And uh, that? Kiwi, it's his day off. Motorcycling. Eight bowling greens. Three golf courses. Croquet. Water slide. Cycling at Cook's Gardens. Athletics. Motor racing in the streets on Boxing Day. Plus a speedway and motocross track. BMX racing. through Jerry Hills or over to 1990. There are only three lifts like it in the world, two for public use, one in Lisbon and one in Wanganui.
1925, we hand-built the memorial tower from Shell Rock mined upriver at Kaifaiki. Took two years to build. The view from the top's well worth the 176 steps. You can get to any part of the region from here. How? Watch the birdie! That's Queen's Park, a restful green spot in the heart of the shopping area. Henry Sargent left us this art gallery in 1912. We have the largest and best collection outside the four main centres. And the building is world famous for its natural lighting. Who's that? One of the old masters. Right in the middle of town, the Memorial Hall is a great conference venue. And the best museum outside the main centres. We have a huge Maori court. A whole floor of natural history. We can show you how to live in a colonial cottage. This is how we looked at the turn of the century. And downstairs, the archives. Is he one of the exhibits? No, but his mummy is. What would you like to do next? Oh, I'm worn out, mate, <laughs> and starving. Right. <laughs> St. Paul's Church at Putiki, one of the most beautiful interiors anywhere. We have been proud of this place since it was built in 1937. Right, dinner. I like Wanganui. It's a magic place, especially the river. Yeah, it's neat, eh? We had it put in in the old days. It does wonders for the tourists. <laughs> <laughs>